Hi everyone, Assalamualaikum and very good morning. Have a nice day to all of you. Today we are going to learn mathematics on topic data management and the content standard collect, classify, and arrange data and also pictograph. Pupils, let us start with what does data mean? Data means a group of information or facts which are collected for reference, analysis, or planning. Now, we are going to collect, classify, and arrange data in a table like this. So, we can find out the data from the picture here. So then, uh, write the type of game first, draw football and kite, then make tally like this. Tally is used to record the frequency of data by simply using a mark such as a bar, line or a note. So look at the draw, there are 4 children playing with the drop. So 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, football. Make a tally for football. One, two, three. Type one, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, after you make tally, count the players. The mark of one bar like this is one. The mark of 5 bar like this is 5, okay? So, drop, look at the drop. The tally 1, 2, 3, 4. So, the number of players is 4. Football, 1, 2, 3. Kite, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. Okay? Now, collect data on the number of girls and boys. Look at girls and boys here. How many girls and how many boys are playing with the games? So, girls, we make tally first. For drought, we have one and two girls. No girl for football game. And the kite, there are one and two girls are playing with the kite. So the number of players of the girls is 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 4. So look at the boy. There are 2 boys playing with the drops. 1 and 2. There are 3 children playing with 3 boys playing with the football. 1 Two and another one like this and there are four children or four boys are playing with the kite one two three four so let us count together one two three four five six seven eight nine nine boys the number of players of the boys is nine okay Okay class, now we will recognize pictograph. What is a pictograph means? A pictograph is a representation of data using images or symbols like this. This is a pictograph about favorite games for a group of children. Favorite game. There are three games here, traps, football and kite. So, this image or symbol of smiley are used to represent the data. One smiley represents one child. So, from this, we can make statements and conclusions based on this data or pictograph. For example, A. There are four children who like to play drugs. Four children. Look at B. Three children like to play football. Okay. C. How many children like to fly kite? Look at this. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six children like to fly kite. 
D. The most favorite game is kite. And D. The least favorite game is football. Now, let's look at the next example involving a pictograph. Alfie collects information on pets of his classmates. So look at this. He asks his friend to raise their hands only once to choose their favorite pets. So from the data findings have been classified and arranged in the following table. So here, the symbol or image of starfish are used. One a symbol or, or one picture of starfish represents one pupil. So look at A. How many pupils keep each pet? Fish is six. Cat is eight. How about rabbit? Rabbit is four. One, two, three, four, four. So the animal that most people keep as pet is cat. And the least pet that of his friend keep is rabbit. Now sharpen your mind. This is a pictograph of Kuei seals. There are four Kuei sold here, curry puff, pao, donut, kochi. The curry puff sold are seven. Donuts. How many donuts? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine donuts are sold. And one, two, three, four, five, six, six kochi are sold. So now, let's us find out how many pao are sold. Pao is sold less one than donut. How many pao is sold? Donut is nine. So one less than nine is eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight pao is sold. Okay, self-test. Look at the pictograph. Answer the questions. This pictograph is related to Nadia's saving in four days. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. So the picture or the symbol or image I use here is a square, a green square. So one green square represents one ringgit. So Look at the question A. How much money is saved on Monday? Monday, one, two, three, three ringgit on Monday. B. Tuesday, the money is saved on Tuesday is two ringgit. B. On what day does Nadia save five ringgit? One, two, three, four, five. So the day Nadia save 5 ringgit is Wednesday. See what is the least money save? The least money save is 2 ringgit. Nadia keeps the same money, amount of money for 2 days. Name the 2 days. So look at this. 3 ringgit and 3 ringgit there are Monday and Thursday. So Monday and Thursday. So E, on what day Nadia's saving is the most? The most. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 ringgit is the most so on Wednesday. Let us solve this. Look at the data of year 1 Pintar pupils ways to school. Arrange the data in a table. Okay, pupils way to school. Look at the picture. They are going to school by bicycle, school bus, motorcycle, and walking. Okay, by bicycle. Let us make a tally. First, one, two, three, four. So the number of people who go to school by bicycle is four. Okay, school bus. Let us make a tally. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. So there are seven pupils 
go to school by school bus. Okay, the motorcycle. Let us count together. One, two, three, four. There are four pupils go to school by motorcycle. And the last one is walking. One, two, three, four, five. There are five pupils go to school by walking. Now look at the data on games of a group of children. There are three games here, Snakes and Letters, Chess and Chonka. So now we are going to arrange the data in the table. Type of games. Snakes and Letters, Chess and Chonka. So let us make a tally for Snakes and Letters. One. Two, three, four, five, and six. So the players are six children. The chess. Let us make a tally. One, two, three, and four. Four children are playing with the chess. Chonka. One and two. There are two children are playing with the chonka. So, what is the most favorite game? The most favorite game is next and letters. Now we look at the pictograph, then solve the problem. The pictograph is related to the tins to recycle, collect by Rosie, Nalini, and Sulin. So, the picture I use here is looks like a cylinder or a tin. So, one picture of this represents one tin. So, Rosie collect one, two, three, four, five tins. Nalini collect one, two, three, four tins. And Swilly collects one, two, three, four, five, six tins. So, the question. A. How many things did Nalini collect? So, Nalini collect 4 things. B. Who collect the most things? We can see here, Sui Lin collect the most things. Okay, that's all for today. Thanks for watching. See you soon.